welcome students let us see a very interesting question from the chapter permutations and combinations here question is a group consists of four girls and seven boys in how many ways can a team of five members be selected if the team has there are three parts of the question first part no girls second at least one boy and one girl and third at least three girls so here what is given given four girls and seven boys so this is given here that number of girls is four and number of boys is seven and we have to form a team of five members we have to form a team of five members let's let us see first part of this question no girls no girls means we have to select all the five members from boys so all we have here first case to select five members from seven boys because there is no any girl so number of members in this team is five so all the five members will be selected from seven boys because there is no any girl in this team okay so in how many ways we can do it in how many ways total number of boys is seven c and we have to select five so seven c five okay and this is equal to seven factorial by five factorial into seven minus five factorial here here we are using the formula n c r is n factorial by r factorial n minus r whole factorial okay so simplify it we'll get the answer here so this is seven factorial by five factorial into two factorial this five factorial we cancel out with seven factorial we'll get here six into seven two factorial is two it will be cancel out with six two three just six so three into seven and this is equal to 21 this is the answer of first part now let us see second part at least one boy and one girl okay so there are some different cases here uh, first of all let us see how many cases can arise first is one boy and one girl second we can take uh here we have to be very careful that at least this word you take care keep note at least one boy and one girl okay and number of members should be five so one boy and one girl at least what does it mean we can select one boy and how many girls four girls because we have to make a team of five so one boy and four girls we have to select in how many ways there are total seven boys so seven c one way into four girls we have to select out of four so that is equal to four c four by simplifying it we'll get the answer of second part so you know seven c one using this formula is seven factorial by one factorial seven minus one is six factorial and into this is four factorial by four factorial into zero factorial so this six will be cancel out this will be seven and uh, four factorial will be cancel out zero factorial is one this is equal to seven so this is case number one now let us see second case let us write here a first case now case number b we can select two boys and three girls 
total number five. So you can select two boys from seven and three girls from four. So selection of selection of two boys and three girls. In how many ways? Two boys we can select out of seven. Seven C two in two. Okay. Job is incomplete here because we have to make a team of five and three girls out of four. So four C three. Similarly, you can simplify this one also. And uh, next third part, we can select three boys and two girls. Selection of three boys and two girls in how many ways? Seven C three. Total number of boys is seven, and we have to select three here. So seven C three. And two girls we have to select from four. So this is into four C two. We can simplify it. Next part. We can select four boys and one girl. Selection of four boys and one girl. In how many ways? Out of seven boys we have to select four. So seven C four into one girl out of four girls so 4 c 1 we can calculate it okay and all the five boys we cannot make that because condition is there must be at least one boy and one girls so finally we will calculate it you calculate this one this one this one And this seven, you get the total after calculating it, and you will find that total number of selection is four hundred forty-one. This will be the answer. We can understand it easily. And third part of this question: at least three girls, maybe more than three, but minimum three girls. Means there are different cases: three girls and two boys, four girls and one boy, because uh, total number of girls is four only. So there is no chance of selecting more than four. So these are two different cases, because condition is there at least three girls, minimum three girls. So three girls and two boys, total five. And four girls and one boy, total five here. So in how many ways? First case, three girls and two boys. Four C three. Total number of girls is four. Out of these four, we are selecting three, and two boys. So seven in C two. Total number of boys is seven, and we are selecting two. Similarly, in this case, we have to select all the four girls. From total number of girls is four, and one boy, so seven C one. Finally, we can get the answer by adding these two numbers. Means four C three into seven C two plus four C four into seven C one. Using this formula, you can calculate it. Definitely, you can calculate it. And after calculation, you will get. This is equal to ninety one. So this is the answer of third part. So this is very important question. So many times these questions are asked in different examinations. So uh, hope you have understood it very well. Uh, thank you very much for watching this video. Wish you all the best.